You know, there is just something terrifying about guys with crazy hand speed, and that certainly applies to this young man. Punches and bunches, as good a combination striking game as we've seen in the UFC in years, and you gotta think the accumulation of punches, which have worn down lesser opponents, could wear down his opponent here tonight. It's one thing to see the hand speed on film, it's another thing to see it in your face on fight night. We'll see how this matchup plays out tonight. This guy is an elite submission fighter. If he can close the distance, get a hold of his opponent, and bring this fight to the ground, his opponent will be in deep, deep trouble. Representing Auckland, New Zealand, here is the last style bender, Israel Adesanya. He comes to the octagon with a whole lot of kickboxing experience and success, and largely that is translated in the big show. He could have come to the UFC several years ago. He wanted to make sure that he was ready, and the early returns are that he is most definitely ready. The takedown defense has been tested early on in his UFC career. Largely, it is held up. Let's see if Israel Adesanya can excite the masses yet again tonight. This guy has incredible takedown defense. Out of all the fighters in the UFC, he's amongst the most difficult to get to the mat. Our tale of the tape for this heavyweight fight. Both fighters 29 years of age. With some differences in height, but big differences in reach. All right, now for the official introductions. Here is Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge, Eve Robin. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the MGM Grand Garden Arena in Las Vegas. It's time! Five rounds in the UFC heavyweight division. It's Rudy Christ fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a freestyle fighter, holding a professional record of 13 wins, 11 losses, and one no contest. He stands 5 feet 10 inches tall, weighing in at 145 pounds, fighting out of Miami, Florida. Bruce Leroy Casares. And now we're producing his opponent fighting out of the red corner. This man is a mixed martial artist, only professional record of 15 wins, no losses. He stands 6 feet 4 inches tall, weighing in at 185 pounds. Israel, the last style bender of a star. Okay, guys, protect yourself at all time. Obey my command at all time. If you want to touch love, do it now. Go back to your corner. All right, here we go. I am fired up for this fight. It's been a long time coming, and they're finally going to get after it. Ready? All right, here we go. All right, so we get another look at Israel Adesanya here tonight. Let's see if he can get off to a fast start. He's not a guy that forces the finish. He will tell you as much that he likes to feel things out a little bit early on. He knows his opponent's going to come shooting at those legs. More often than not, short sample size in the UFC, but Israel Adesanya's takedown defense has held up. Lands the right punch and follows it up with a nice left hand. Nice sequence there by Caceres. All right, so let's see how the early portions of this fight play out. Whoa! Wow! Whoa! This could be it. Oh, look at this. Who saw that coming? Try to establish that jab. Caceres gets caught with that punch. Got to shore up the defense here. Joe, pretty good head movement to slip that right hand. Push kick there to the body. Oh, he moved right into the kick there. A kick to the head lands, and he's shown a susceptibility to that in fights prior. You can't lean into those power shots. Let's see if he can circle out and make the adjustments here. Oh, 
Very nice leg kick there by Caceres. Punch is blocked. Slips. That one got Bruce Leroy's attention. Just over three minutes now to go in round one. Oh, misses with the jab. Israel Adesanya gets caught with that punch. He'd be wise to get those hands up, Joe. Went for the inside leg kick. Didn't quite connect. Good uppercut attempt. Oh. Looked like it did stun him a little bit. He's got him hurt here. How about that shin? He fell! Oh. him in the face! Man! Just over two minutes to go. Oh! oh. The kick lands. He's hurt. He's down. Back to the feet. Left kick to the body. And there he swung with the haymaker. Sonya gets absolutely punished by that head kick. Oh, he got cracked with the jab there, Joe, and his head is firmly on the center line, the one place it really can't afford to be. He's showing some vulnerability here by leaning right into his opponent's range. Let's see if he can make some adjustments here. Looked like Caceres might have just missed with that right hand. One minute to go here in the opening round. Just oh! oh, he's getting hit. Beautiful body, body shot. shot there, too. Oh, straight right. Watch the shot here, Joe. Nice job to land the kick to the body there by Caceres. Tried to set up the straight left, but he missed. Oh! Slightly deflected. Oh, that kick is good by Caceres. And there's a nice jab. Oh! The horn sounds for the end of round one. Oh, what a way to end the round. Saved by the bell. He got stunned by a huge shot right before the horn. And now, a little bit gingerly, he makes his way back to the stool. And he's only got 60 seconds to recover here. So we'll see if his corner, physically, mentally, can keep this fighter in the fight. And here we see another huge punch that stuns his opponent. And here is one more massive punch he lands that really stuns. Several near fight ending moments in that round. Lots of action. Ready? Ready? Round two here. He's definitely going to want to start this round off fast to try to pick up where he left off. His opponent was in big trouble at the end of that round. Oh, solid jab. Wow! He's got him hurt here. Oh, oh he's out. Oh, he's out. That's it. He's out. And he's just out. like the that, fight the fight is, fight is over. over. Wow. Landed a big kick for the knockout. 
Oh, absolutely one for the highlight reel right there. A tremendous kick to spell the end of the night for his opponent and for him, I should say, but just caught him flush, full force, beautiful extension on the kick, and the fight was really over as soon as that one made contact. I'm not even sure he was conscious when he hit the canvas. Outstanding performance here tonight. And let's check that out from a different angle. Well, hard to perform much better than he did tonight. A huge knockout under the lights. They'll be talking about that one for some time. Now we go inside the octagon. Ladies Bruce Buffer with the official decision. This contest at 21 seconds of round number two. Becoming the winner by knockout, Israel, the last time bender, Alessandra. He is the last style bender, Israel Adesanya, and he gets another UFC win here tonight. And he has really been critical of his past performances inside the octagon, but a whole lot to like out of this effort here tonight. Going to be interesting to hear how Adesanya felt about what he was able to accomplish inside this arena tonight.